Hey what's going on guys, today I have a ball control video for you and similar to the dribbling video I released yesterday, to start I want to give you a few helpful tips, some ideas to focus on while you're doing these drills and afterwards I will give you a short but very effective training routine to improve your ball control and your first touch. So the first thing I want to say, and you may have heard this a hundred times, your coach is always telling you, play on your toes, don't be on your heels. And this is so true for this drill, but just anytime you are doing drills, whether it's by yourself or with your teammates, make it a habit. Always on your toes, have a little bounce in your step, quick to react. If you're sitting flat-footed on your heels, your reaction time is going to be very poor. And as you get older, you get smarter, you start to understand what makes a player effective, you will start to learn that your movement is just as important as your technique. So really focus on your movement as much as your touches. The next thing I want to say is focus and this may seem a bit ridiculous what do you mean I am focusing when I'm doing these drills but actually focus on every single touch watch that ball meet your foot exactly on the point that you want it to hit to produce the touch that you want it sounds a bit ridiculous but if you learn to really just watch that ball all the way to your foot make flush contact with your foot you're gonna have much better touches and much more consistency the last thing I want to say and this is just a helpful tip for passing but also these ball control drills is over hit your passes it's much better for you to hit the ball too hard than too weak if you're in a game and you hit your pass too weak it's going to get intercepted you're going to lose possession if you hit it too hard at least it will get to your teammate and he can still deal with it so when you're doing these drills it also helps to hit your passes too hard rather than too weak and also hit them too high off the wall rather than too low if they're too high you can still react to them even though it's not ideal if they're too low it's probably going to go into the ground so just think about those ideas being light on your toes really focusing on your technique watching that ball to your foot and over hitting your passes so here's a little workout you can do there are six different exercises you can do two minutes for each again these are just recommendations if you want to do more feel free to do more now I'll let the video play again and you can watch each drill to learn exactly what you should be doing thank you for watching this video if you found it helpful please like please comment please share please subscribe if you have any questions on this topic or any topic comment below and please come back tomorrow and let's keep training keep getting better and keep taking your game to the next level thanks for watching and i'll talk to you soon